Oh, God oh, my, hey, oh. There's my t-shirt. Oh, oh. Hello, guys. Just give me one second to get my top on. Helpful if it wasn't inside out. And we are ready to rock and roll. How is it going, guys? Sir Teapot here. And today we are back with more story of Teapot. And today is a very humid but miserable-ish looking day. Because apparently it's going to thunderstorm today, which is uh, quite quite lovely when I've got work today. Uh, but today is the 25th of uh, June. God, I had to think about that then because it's proof. It's that warm. My brain's just literally fried in my head. Uh, but yeah, it is the 26th today of June, which is a Friday, and it is currently about like half past uh, 10, no, quarter to, quarter to 11 actually, and I have got work at 2 o'clock today until, uh, yeah, 2 till 9 today I'm on, uh, I was supposed to be on a 5, 9, but uh, my manager asked me if I can come in a bit earlier, so I'm going in early today, which I don't really mind too much, and um, today I will do the Pokemon, and yesterday obviously, was good old Eva, which to us, I'm going to put in Eva's room in a moment. But today, oh, it's Togepi! And who doesn't love Togepi? Togepi is great. But uh, I'm going to go put this in Eva's room in a minute because I'm not going to keep it in here. And I'm going to go say hello to Eva in a minute and get my day started. So, I was going to uh, take Eva's uh, little Pokemon thing into, into her, but uh, I needed to uh, actually quickly go to the toilet this morning. And then, so by the time I ended up finishing at the toilet, um, I ended up, uh, Evie, uh, la, la, la. Kim had already brought Evie downstairs, so uh, I'm going to show her it a bit later on. I'm pretty sure she's already seen Evie before, like, um, but I don't want to see if she'd actually react and see if she actually seems like she liked Evie or not. Uh, but she, uh, we are currently just chilling out while Kim makes uh, Evie her bottle, I believe. And um, me and Kim are going to be ordering ourselves some breakfast soon. I'm thinking Kim just wants a... Baking time with something like that, but I'm not quite sure what I want myself yet. So, me and um, Kim have ordered food again, uh, to no one's surprise. And I am having a sausage and hash brown sandwich today. And Kim is having baking time here. And I've just been playing... Yeah, Evie's just having bits of our bread. And I've been playing some Call of Duty while we watch some Ryan play some Call of Duty. Uh, but I'm going to turn Cod off for, a, for now, because I am due at work in... Oh, God, an hour and a half, nearly. God, as if it's that soon. Um, but I'm due at work in an hour, an hour and a half, and I'm there. I need to set off at about one o'clock, and it's now uh, thirty-five minutes to. Well, no, thirty-five minutes till then. I don't know why thirty-five minutes to, but thirty-five minutes till then. So it's twenty-five past now. Uh, so I'm gonna eat this, get ready, and get off for one o'clock, and then I need to get on the bus at about twenty-five past one. So I am now ready to get off, and I'm enjoying my Kim and Eva. So, give me a kiss, give you a kiss, and I'm going to be getting off. So, yeah, I'm going to, I've got, well, I need to get off actually, because I'm running five minutes late, so I should be in the bus station here about ten, five, five minutes. Yeah, probably like five, ten minutes, because really don't really take me that long to get there. So, I'm now on my um, my bus to Dewsbury, and I'll tell you something, it is really, really warm on this bus, like, stupid hot. Um, so... Um, I've got to back at bus because there's windows open on this side of the bus and I'm hoping that the breeze will cool me down quite a bit because I am, like I said, just dying from heat. I'm going to sit in the middle of the bus, hopefully. There we go. That's a lot better. I'm actually getting it by a breeze now. Um, but yeah, like I said, it is way too warm. But there is, um, there's some, there's two people up here at the moment. Uh, obviously, me at the back of the bus, but there's a few people downstairs as well. Um, but so once again, the buses are still extremely quiet. Um, but I, sh um, I should be at work in the next like 15 20 minutes, and then, like I said, I start at um, 2 o'clock today, uh, and then I finish at 9 o'clock. So I've got a pretty lengthy shift, um, so I should go and break at about 6 o'clock. So, um, I should, well, unless I end up going on break a bit early, but it's very, very unlikely. So, guys, I'm now on my way to work, and I took a different one, um, route than I normally would to work today. Um, actually, I normally go over that side of the road, but today I decided to go on just through the little um, shopping bit that was behind me. Just see if they were all open, just see what actually is open at the moment. But it wasn't a whole lot, really. It was pretty, <coughs> excuse me, it was pretty empty. 
Um, there wasn't too much really going on. But we're busy at shop, well, quid shop to be honest, which was quite surprising. Um, and I kind of expected uh, Greg's to be open as well, but to be honest, that wasn't open either, which is a bit of a surprise to be honest, because I know everywhere else that it's been open, it's been extremely busy, so I'm quite surprised that it didn't open in Dewsbury. But yeah, I should be at work in the next like five, ten minutes, not even that. And I've got 50 minutes to play to get there, so as soon as I get to work, I'll be getting a drink. It's probably chilling out in staff room for like five, ten minutes anyway. And then you probably won't see me again until about six o'clock, which then I'll be um, doing all my sharing for my vlog, for which is yesterday's vlog technically, because uh, I'll because all my vlogs now should be going up from six o'clock now. Because I believe I've changed it time, but we'll see how change it to six o'clock does us. I am now on break at work, and I'm gonna have literally a quick like 15, 20 minute break. If that, I usually have like half an hour, but. I'm gonna rush it today because uh, there's plenty of stuff that needs doing today, so I'm just gonna literally go out, grab myself literally a quick bite to eat, and uh, a drink because I'm dying from the heat, as you can probably tell with how loose I'm wearing my t shirt. And uh, yeah, I'm expected to finish a bit later than I um, anticipated today. I was supposed to finish at 9, but it looks like I might be finishing about 10 o'clock ish, but that really have a problem with that, don't really mind too much. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try and find my earphones and then start, well, go get some food and uh, just sit down and chill out for just for a little bit and just have a breather. So I have now finished work and I'm on my way to the bus station. And I'll tell you something, I'm absolutely fucking exhausted today. Like, I feel like I've been battered. I've been non-stop um, since, well, since I went on break, since I came off a of break, I've been non-stop since then. Um, and I've really been non-stop non -stop throughout my entire shift. So I'm a bit, well, like I said, exhausted, um, but, I'm making my way home now. I got myself a fresh pineapple to have when I get home, which is going to be very, very nice. Um, but might be a bit of a nightmare to cut apart, but I'll work it out. I've never, I've never actually had a full pineapple like this before, like ever. So should be quite interesting to see how that goes. But uh, once I get home, I think I'm just going to literally sit down and not move for about a solid maybe a couple of hours because I'm just going to lay there like because I've been sat in what feels like one second forever so as soon as I get home it's going to be me sitting down chilling out and just playing some video games so guys I am now on my way home and I'm off the bus and everything like that um, and I am just like I said walking through Osset um, so it shouldn't be too long until I'm actually at home but um, that bus journey was a uh, interesting one so uh, there was only me and one other person but one other person on the bus and obviously then the bus driver as well um but we got to about about three quarters away through the journey or something like that and uh they just all of a sudden the bus driver just slammed on me all these brakes and i'm like what the fuck and they ended up flying out off of my seat so i look outside thinking like maybe he nearly hit a cat or a dog or something like that he just run in front of something and i thought oh It'll, get, it'll start going in a minute, um, but no, it didn't start going, and all of a sudden, he turns to me and shouts that bus, um, don't think we're going anywhere for a minute, because uh, I can't get through, it's, it's happened like, so every time I've been this way tonight, and I went, ah, right, great, just what I need when I want to be home, <laughs> um, so I'm sat there on the phone to Kim explaining it to her, being like, don't think I'm going to be um, home, overly quick tonight and she was like why am I well because we're flipping stuck um and then he goes he shouts out at bus to someone being like um can you get them to move the car again or something like that and they went I don't think they're, they're gonna answer the door or something like that and she went and he said um well it was like I'm ringing police and I went oh great that's gonna take even bloody longer than it's than, than needed so it was just gonna end up being dragged out way more than it needed to be um, but then I believe the people that were across the road um, ended up coming out at the opposite side of the street basically from the car that needed moving. He pulled his car forward so then the bus could like get onto the path and work its way around in a sense. But it was an absolute nightmare and we were sat there nearly like 10-15 minutes so now it's like half past 10 at night um, and I'm nearly home, nearly about 5-10 minutes until I'm home so it won't be till like won't be home until about 20 to, 12, uh, 20 to 11 or something like that. So, like, I'm I'm definitely feeling it today. It's been a chuffing long, long, 
long day today. Uh, but like I said, as soon as I get in, I'm just going to chill out. And to be honest, I don't think I'm going to be playing video video games or anything really tonight. I think I'm literally, like I said, just going to sit in my chair uh, and just collapse and just chill out for a bit and let my feet rest. Because I've been on my feet that long as well. My feet are absolutely killing me. But um want to be able to hopefully I get home before Evie also gets to sleep because she is, well, I was obviously on the phone to came on the bus and she said that she was, ah, it's your maid with a bloody pineapple. <laughs> um, she said that she was falling asleep then, so I'm hoping when I get home, she hasn't fallen asleep and then I can actually see her at least for a little bit. So I am now home and dressed and changed and everything like that and just ready to chill out, but giving Evie a bedtime cuddle and kids and everything like that because she's just hanging on by her friend. As you can probably tell, she's struggling quite hard, to be honest. She's literally grasping at life currently, trying to just hold on a little bit, but uh, Kim's got her a bottle ready and made and everything like that, so uh, <laughs> she's going to give her that in a moment and uh, got that nice little smile out of her before bed. Um, but it is now 10 past 11, so we definitely do need to get her to sleep. So I actually need to outro this vlog because I haven't actually done one yet. Um, I believe in the last clip you saw, literally I got home and was giving Evie a cuddle and we were getting ready to take her up to bed uh, and it were about 20 past 11ish. Um, and literally we got her to bed and not long after that, Kim went to bed and not long after that I went to bed myself. So there weren't really too much else to film for the rest at night. Uh, so like I said, didn't want to just fill the vlog with pointless content. I don't think I just played COD for like about like 45 minutes an hour or something like that but like i was just even too tight to even play it properly and end up playing really poorly anyway um, but anyway guys thank you guys for watching if you did enjoy today's video make sure you do leave a like and do subscribe also if you if you could um if you could subscribe as well that'd help massively also guys in down in the description below is a link to all our social media and stuff like that also as well there is a link to our patreon if you'd like to support us obviously if you can't we appreciate that you just watch the videos anyway anyway guys i shall see you in tomorrow's video at Hopefully either 5pm or 6pm. And peace.